and we are back hey this is Nidot here and today we are playing the librarian which looks awesome i think the, the graphics look just look amazing i mean i like the retro style type of games but yeah i'm curious about this game to my dad Okay, that's nice. That's nice. Okay. Nice, nice piano. Nice piano. Good start. Nice artwork. Like I said, like seeing images of this game, I it's really very appealing to me at least because I'm I'm just crazy about retro style of games. Octavi Navarro. That's that's the guy who made the supper right i love the supper by the way that's uh that gameplay is on my channel as well check it out it's oh look at this artwork it's so cozy i, I like the style of this room and whoa that's less nice okay whoa and like the supper it's a click and point type of game nice um uh, candle hey agent owl nice yeah he, ha he has a note or oh, she something is wrong in the library oh no thanks for uh, giving me a heads up what, what is this can i use something else what is book? I have a book. Okay, let's just... Uh, downstairs. That's the only thing I can click on. So let's go downstairs. We can go upstairs again. And... Books. Nice. I, I really love this artwork. The retro style wardrobe i can click on the wardrobe oh nice and i have a spirit dagger awesome spirit dagger <laughs> nice that's right very, very cute wine decanter ah are we going to sip a little bit of wine well i look books all over the place i love this i love the okay i'm gonna annoy people with saying how much i love this artwork and the atmosphere and just the design of this room and everything i would love to have a house like this <laughs> i'm kind of old-fashioned Ooh, look at the background it's very nice whoa <laughs> the freaking what what is this Bodo? okay ah! i can't go there that this thing will bite me or whatever it is it's drinking the puddle Okay, I, I really can't go there. It, it will it will eat my head or something. Can I? Ah, okay, I can't attack it. Uh. Well, the only thing I can do is <laughs> putting wine in the puddle. It got drunk. <laughs> ah, I see. I see. Nice. Now I can pass, right? <laughs> okay. Main street. Nice houses. Now, where is the library? That is my question. Okay. Library. Great door lock. You can't go in, huh? Um, broken.
broken window. Aha! Hey! Tree branch. Broken window. <laughs> that reminds me of the supper when the old lady is trying to grab the pigeon. For the people who don't know what I'm talking about. Never mind, I'm crazy. I'm, I'm, I'm just talking about a pigeon. <laughs> watch the supper. Watch that gameplay. It's on my channel. Uh, that's an E. Candle. Lots of books. Lots of books. Huh. We don't know what. Well, there's a missing book. Is it this? Ah! I knew it. I could smell it. Okay, well, it's complete now. The collection is complete. I had the missing book. But what is wrong with the library? What else is wrong? Um... Strange machine. Broken handle. Okay. Odd. Odd. But I can't click on much else right here, right? Nope. And I have a spirit dagger. That's the only thing I have right now. Um, broken handle. Think, think, think. Oh, wait. Tree branch. I could click on this. Nice. C can I use this as a broken handle? Branch. Oh, <laughs> I thought it was going to... <laughs> yeah that makes sense handle now we have a handle peeps nice oh this is so awesome dudes but it helps that i'm kind of used to uh the this game developers other game mechanics point and click because the supper was also like a lot of searching and clicking on stuff can i go upstairs Okay, thank you. Thank you. Hey, what do we have here? Button. We have a button. Mom, we have a button. Button. Are those? Well, what are those? What are those signs? We have an O. Something, something. Something that looks like an A. A V? But I, I can't... Oh, I... Oh. What? Does it do something? Whoa! Did that do something? What, what happened? Um, nothing that I can see. What is this? Door lock. Use the dagger. No? Okay. And that's a two. So the <laughs> it wasn't a Y. It, it was a one. And that's a two. Well, oh. I didn't even see this corpse lying around here. Former librarian. Well, you have a promising future, lady. Uh, hey, red lens. Give me that red lens. Okay, what was that it? Right, that was it, huh? Okay, well, I have a red lens. Nice. Nice. Let's go uppity up. Uppity flip flop. Hey, a student. Is he dead as well? 
Something tells me that this library is cursed. Lots of people dead all over this place. It's not a good library. Student, hey! Middle finger, ring finger. Oh! Oh! I see! These are the. These are the signs on the buttons. Should I go clockwise or they need to be in some sort of order, right? Okay, wait, let me remember this. I need to remember this. That's the weird V thing. Y. Circle. Dot dots. And the weird looking A. So the V. The Y. Circle thing. A or is it clockwise? Let's let's play with the buttons and see what order it needs to be in. Okay. Now we we had the strange looking V thing. Unless it's clockwise. Should I do clockwise or um let's try this. Okay, push the button. Mom, push the button. Okay. Yes. The second one was the... This thing, right? Right. And the third one was the O. Right. And then the fourth one was the A. Unless it's clockwise. Hey! There was it! Or did I break something? Ah! Wow! No, dude! What the frick is. What? Corroded soul? Ah! Okay, I, I can't charge it. I need to. Red lens? Should I use the red lens on it? Or a spirit? A spirit dagger would make sense, right? On a corroded soul? I think so. Chaka! Take that, corroded soul! A Deroic. Nice, nice, nice. I'm a natural. I'm a natural. What is this? Iron Sphere. Do you guys think what I'm thinking? I'm thinking phantasm. We are getting some cool phantasm stuff. <laughs> okay, we have an iron sphere and a red lens. Oh, the third floor door must be open right now, right? Because we did the thing, we did the buttons. Okay, poor student. I mean, that's how I looked ever after like a week of studying. I'm not kidding. Wait, it's still not open. What do I need to do then? Round socket. Yes. Oh, I'm so smart. Our darkest times. You mean 2020? <laughs> Whoa! Wait, did I die? Uh... What happened? I'm in a different dimension or something. Uh... Oh, now I can go upstairs. That's the dead student. Let's go upstairs. Go upstairs. Please. Thank you. Hey, we have another puzzle. Not a puddle, a puzzle. And how can I solve this puzzle? Mind you. Dear sir, what buttons do I have to push? Oh. Um, yeah, let, let's... Where can I get the code? We need to figure this out. We need to... Calm down, people. We need to figure this out. 
Don't panic. I will figure this out. Um. Yeah. Go downstairs, I guess. Maybe we will find some clues downstairs. No? Can we go more downstairs? Maybe? Everything is fricked up in this dimension, dude. Look at this. That's... Everything is a weird glitch. Where can I... I'm searching for clues. Two thousand years later. Um... Well, the only thing I can interact with here are the candles. From what I've seen. And the skeleton... Okay. All right. I get it now. I need to go to the first floor, right? And then um, do that to all of them. There it is. Come on. Squiggly line. Okay. That is first floor. First floor is squiggly line. Remember that. Squiggly line. First floor, squiggly line. This is the candle. So squiggly line, first floor. That's... Let's say that, that that's like a fish. <laughs> I know it can be a cup or something. Squiggly line, fish. Whatever. I'm not being picky here. This is the third one. No, what do you mean you don't know? Three line fish and what? Okay, yeah, I don't know what to call that. Let's. I I must be stupid or something. J don't judge me. Don't don't judge me. Okay, okay, we're just going to call that object three. Squiggly line fish object three. Go upstairs. Thank you. Thank you. Okay. And this is the brain, or whatever. So, squiggly line. And the second one... Yeah, that was the fish. The third one... Was... Object 3. Fourth one brain. Yes! Ha! Ah, we have a ladder! Nice. Let's go uppity up. Up. Uppity up. Ooh. Be careful. Don't fall off. Okay. We have another ladder. Surprising. Okay. Glass door. No, you don't know what to do with a glass door? Whoa, that's a huge crow? Is that a crow? That's a key. Library key. Ah, dude. That, oh, ow. Okay, I can't get the key there. So what do I need to do? Oh, the screen that killed my eardrums also broke the glass door. Nice. We have a baby crow. Trap baby crow. Oh no, that's cute. I grabbed it. So I need to bring this to the mama crow, I, I think, right? Hey! Hey, Mama Crow! Yeah, take this! 
Nice. Grab the key. Grab it. Okay, there I am. And that's when my audio decided to be a complete bloody bastard. It suddenly, it suddenly started to act weird. I don't know why. I did not push any buttons. I did not change any settings. My mic was just like, you know what? Screw you, dude. Yeah, look at me talking, thinking the volume is all normal. Don't I look like a fool? I am a fool. Why didn't I check the volume? Why didn't I? Well, I, I couldn't have known. Anyways, the point is, I'm a complete idiot for not noticing that the audio volume suddenly dropped and was very low. Anyways, the conclusion of this game was pretty sweet. I love this game. I truly adore the games this creator makes. Like, I also played The Supper, which is a great game in my opinion. These uh, point and click kind of games can be very intriguing if done well. And the art style of this one, I think, is excellent. But I'm a sucker for retro things. The soundtrack of this game is excellent. It truly adds to the atmosphere of the game. I think it's just excellent. And I just, I just love the atmosphere. The books, the crow, the owl, <laughs> it's just, it's very nice. But yeah, this was Nitat, not noticing the audio drop, being a complete idiot, re-recording the audio now, Lililo Gaming, and bye bye